What's up? Scarlett Johansson's pictures have been leaked onto the internet. As a security professional, it's my duty though to say this is wrong, data has been breached, and I must say how people can go about to prevent this from happening. Crazy Hollywood celebrities. I mean, what is it with you and new technology? Do, do you just get a phone and do this? Wow, the new camera on this phone is awesome. I need to take a romantic picture and send it to my girlfriend. I know. Or worse still, it appears as if anyone with a tripod and a camcorder ends up, you know, doing something far worse. It's been three hours. Help. And this has just happened again and again. You, you see one celebrity after another falling for this, uh, oh, it leaked, ex-boyfriend done this, ex-girlfriend done that, someone hacked into my phone, someone hacked, broke into my house, and they, they took all this precious stuff. This isn't something just restricted to celebrities, of course. I mean, how many times has this happened in the house? Have you seen the memory card with all of our wedding photos on them? And not to mention, things like this happening in your office. I'm, I'm really sorry boss, I lost my laptop. Mm, but it was encrypted. Uh, no, didn't get round to encrypting it. It didn't have any customer dates on it, did it? Well, it was really slow to connect to the server, so I copied the whole database. I give up. Okay, the point of the matter is, Information is everywhere, whether it be in your personal life or whether it be your work life or whether it be looking after information that other people have entrusted with you. And, you know, a lot of this is sensitive and it's very easy for it to get out, especially if you leave it on your phone, which gets stolen or you leave it in the back of a taxi somewhere. So all it takes is a bit of care, a bit of due diligence and a bit of common sense, really. And you can prevent things like this from happening. A lot of people will come down and say, oh, well, if the phone had encryption or if it had this technology or that technology, these things wouldn't happen. But think about it. If you left all your valuables in the front seat of your BMW and someone broke in and took it, would you blame BMW for making an insecure car? Or would they just say that you're an idiot for leaving your valuables in the front seat of your car? Stay secure, my friends.